you have anything that you want to yeah. plug about your shop or anything like that? Oh, goodness. Everybody go to paducahometheater.com and buy everything possible. <laughs> We've implemented a great rewards program. If you buy on the site, you basically get 10% back. So there's some things we can't discount, lots of stuff. So, um, yeah, we'll be adding a lot more prolific stuff here recently or very soon. But, uh, but yeah, we, we stock all the clip heritage. We stock all the SVS stuff. Uh, we've got pallets and pallets of prolific. So, um, yeah, we're good friends with Steve Jane at uh, Fidelity Imports. So we've got all the stuff that he carries. So we just picked up a uh, gold note, just really high end, um, amplifiers. Uh, they got a ton of turntables. Uh, we got Michelle engineering uh, turntables. Um, really cool stuff that, that was actually, if you look at Steve, Whoa. Steve jobs, um, office, he had one of those in the, like on his shelf. So pretty iconic. Look at that. They're not the easiest thing to set up, but uh, they're, <laughs> that they're does really, not look that, like it. that gyro SE is the most popular. That's see, cause those little gold things, they, uh -huh. you know, they, they go around with a platter. So when you, it starts spinning, it's just, really Oh, cool. you get, you get a little light show yeah, too. It's something to watch. It's totally isolated too. It's like, it's, I mean, it's sitting on uh, three legs, but those things are like spring loaded. And uh, the motor is completely, you see how there's a space? The mm -hmm. motor's completely isolated. Oh, isolated over um, here, huh? So, yeah, very nice turned out. Yeah, so, no, definitely. With a, with a price to match, too. Damn. Uh, I'm going to put you on the spot here, Corey. What, uh, oh, what do you have on your system? What do you, what kind of what's setup? What's your system? system? Yeah. What's yeah, your home? Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, at home. Not at the shop. What does what does Corey have at your, the Yeah, at your house. What did you choose to I put in? I use the Q acoustic up to five hundreds. And I do that because um we're kind of weird in that we have like a we have like a Florida style house. We've got a lot of pastels, a lot of whites, a lot of uh, neutrals. Um which we one got, is? we got this fish mount. Yeah. So we use that because it just it's freaking beautiful. Look at the white ones. So oh, hold on, let me the fit and finish is just second to none um we, it's the 500 those are the smaller 50s mm -hmm. it's the 500 that i have okay the 500 but, um, yeah oh these so look at that so Boom. that looks uh just really good in her Damn. house but also it's very comfortable so our main living room is very reflective we got a little, you know we've got a lot of uh hard surfaces and it's it's in a it's in a situation where um we're we're not able to do the room justice with room treatments so um these are actually extremely comfortable that the the top end is rolled off a little bit but it's it's a silk dome so even in a reflective room you can jam with them pretty good and super comfortable we pair that with the english acoustics tube amp um they um they can paint those in any color that you want so basically what we did is um um, I can't say the color name, but uh, it's let's call it robin egg blue. So <laughs> it's a certain it's a certain color you find on certain jewelry boxes. But oh, uh, oh okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. It's really it's really cool, but uh, yeah, it's mostly. So which, which color do you have? We what have the you, white ones. You, so so they're, they're not on here, are they? Are they not? I don't think so. Oh goodness, I'm slacking. <laughs> oh wait, wait, there they are, there they are, there. Yeah. Just damn, really, look at that. Really the ones that, uh, that have the crazy stand when you have the bookshelf version, is that the one with like the weird? Those at the shop. Yeah, those are neat because those are the, uh, yeah, the 300s right there. Those things wobble around. So it, it uh, yeah, it's just completely isolated from the floor. Um, oh, it doesn't yeah, show you put, the... If you put them on the stands, like it's it's got like a rubber mount and it just kind of wobbles around. This thing right here, this stand right here? Yeah, those stands. Like, so it's the, uh, it wobbles? Yeah, at, at least on the, I forget if these do, I think they do, but uh, at least on the 300, yeah, mm -hmm. you can take the top and just barely touch it and the whole bookshelf just kind of wobbled around. So is it like, so, so everybody like, thinks they're, they're everybody thinks gonna fall off. broken. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, no, dude, it's not. Broken. So it's meant to be like that. So it's just like, it's, yeah, it's isolated, isolated from the stand. Oh, wow. That's so crazy. There's no coloration going back to the floor, basically. Yeah. So, so it's decoupled. Right? Yeah. 
And these look pretty sexy though. I but yeah, it. that's that's my personal in that's one of my systems. Downstairs we're putting in a system that um yeah, we we've just now gotten the drywall up. Unfortunately, Paducah, Kentucky, um, and drywall contractors don't go together very well. <laughs> So I've been having a real hard time with that. You guys, if you guys know any, anybody that can help Corey out with his drywall in the Kentucky area. So anyways, we've got, um, we, we actually have four 18s up front. We've got four SB 16 ultras in the back. Um, so it's, it's going to be just, just JVC projector. Um, wow. Wow. Yeah. We've got, uh, for listen everywhere it's a for listen um surrounds um yeah i i didn't know the q Q q acoustics had so much so many like oh, so many are, models man like um, are great. i've only seen the bookshelves well the and, 3000 series or the see those 3020 eyes that's got to be their most i yeah, reviewed those, those everybody loves these things so that's the, that's got to be their most popular. Mm. And the 3050 eyes are just little monsters. You'd be surprised with the, you know, for full MSRPs, 1100 bucks at this point, you'd be really surprised oh, what they can do. Yeah. So, Is this for each or a pair? Um, that's a pair. Pair for yeah. 1100. So yeah, that's a really good wow. bang for your buck. So. Yeah. Yeah. Cause when you, when you pointed out the ones you have, I'm like, damn, I didn't yeah. know. I didn't know they've got $7,000 bakers. Yeah. Those are, they do some cool stuff, like on the like concept fifties. I think that I get them all mixed up, but pretty sure those have like a gel in them. So it's almost like two enclosures, and it's got a what's up, what's it's up, got man? a gel that's sandwiched in between them. So this this stand thing's kind of weird. What's yeah, it's kind of just a modern design. It's uh, it's it a, adds some stability, but it's cool looking. That no. That that wouldn't fly in my house. I'd, I'd be like, ah, right. now it just makes it, it makes it wider. Like right. I wouldn't be able to fit them. You know, I mean, you they even got seat in ceilings. They got all kinds of stuff. Oh so, yeah. Okay, yeah. great. Have to look into some cute. Yeah, look at the. Make sure to check out our audio only version of the podcast at anchor.fm forward slash daily hi fi, or just go to your favorite podcasting service and search for daily hi fi.